I always carry some drier lint around in my when I'm out hiking. Today I'm out on the sled. Just doing some exploring. You never know when you're gonna get cold and you're gonna need it. This stuff is amazing for fire starter. Alright folks, we're out in the bush today. <coughs> Figured I'd uh, do something a little bit different. Uh, just out exploring some new territory with the sled. Um, stuff like that. Nice winter day. It's pretty warm out. It's beautiful actually. We got a pile of snow as you can see. It's like over my knees to tug deep it is once you get off the trail here. Off the ski trail. It's beautiful. Out in some big big spruce. Just marshy, swampy stuff. Um, one of my subscribers sent me one of these MREs. I haven't had this particular uh, menu yet. It's pulled pork menu 12, Canadian military. Um, so yeah, we'll get this a try. Thanks to, uh, to the guy that sent it to me. Um, really appreciate it. <laughs> uh, I don't think I've ever mentioned it, but I actually quite enjoy these things. So. I use them like when I go shed hunting quite a bit or when I'm camping I actually eat quite a few of these so let's see what we got in here I already opened it just to see if if I needed to bring a pot boiling water or whatever so I opened it to see what was inside but first thing we got here is turquillas put them by the fire here in a minute to warm them up main menu is pulled pork got this uh, I'm not sure what this is oh this is a date square can't really see nothing this is a beverage bag fill this up with water put your um, beverage in here we got peanut butter raspberry jam that over there Basco, a spork, phone, and a fork, or a spoon and a fork together. Oh, this is my favorite. Nescafe coffee. It's a three-in-one. It's got sh it's got coffee, sugar, and uh, uh, coffee whitener all in one. Amazing stuff. This is a compressed napkin. You add water to it, and you got a napkin. And we also got. Lemon lime, lemon lime sports drink, some matches. I didn't need any matches to start this fire. I had a lighter with me. I always carry one when I'm out skidooing or whatever, so you never know when you're gonna need it. So it says here cooking instructions with this stuff. Some of them have a a uh, a little compartment thing that you literally take apart, add some water, close it up, put your packet of food in with it and then it heats it up but these ones do not it says place on open pouch in pot of boiling water well i didn't bring a pot because i didn't have a pot that i wanted to throw away or whatever so what i got is a foil container I'm curious to see if this thing is actually going to work to pot boil or to boil water because it's pretty thin. So I'm just going to get some snow from over here. No shortage of that. We'll get some water going here now on the coals. I don't want to get it into uh, too. Uh, I don't want to get it over the flames because it might get off. Burn a hole through that. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's a beautiful country, man. And this bush goes for miles and miles. So beautiful. I think what I'm going to do with this pulled pork is uh, I'm going to open it and put it into that uh, little foil container I have. And just cook it that way. The container's not really big enough to um, 
the container's not big enough to put the pouch in, so it's not going to work the way I wanted it to. But... All right, this water's hot enough for me. Coffee. Got a little charcoal in there, that's all right. Oh, yeah. Man. Oh, yeah, there's a piece of charcoal right there. Oh, well, whatever. Never hurt no one, I don't think. Let's try it out. Oh, hot. Oh, that tastes too good. Oh, yeah. So. Next up is the pulled pork. smells good As you guys can see that wow we're gonna play right into our little container here it's kind of frozen man that's a pretty big piece of pork right there Looking at. So basically, looks like we got a pork patty there, but it's just uh, um, the pulled pork's just all mushed together into a patty. So break that apart. Try not to let it spill. Well, let's heat this up and uh, eat up here in a sec or two. It's gonna be good. This is not how watery it is. I just added a bit of water to keep it from burning the bottom of this pan. All right, just let it cook for a second there. Your tortillas as you take them and hang them over this stick like a bush toaster oh man this one broke oh well still gonna eat it I'm starving man I had it already heating up got the bush toaster going Pull pork's cooking down there. She's almost ready to go. Take your tortilla, fold her in half. Scoop some of this stuff in there. Some potatoes, I think. That's what that is. We'll get some more. Make yourself a little sandwich and eat up. Oh, it's soupy. Coyote's gonna love this spot. Mm. Mm -hmm. Tastes exactly like pulled pork you have when you make it or go out and eat it wherever. You wouldn't, I couldn't taste the difference. Not at all. Somebody gave me this. You couldn't tell me that this was an MRE. So good. Coffee, real good too. It's getting chilly out, the sun went away.
get this heated up. <laughs> Date square. Oh, that smells good. Um, here. Use my toaster stick. I must set it on. Hopefully everybody had a good Christmas, good new year coming up. Yeah, yeah. I uh, was planning to make a few of these videos. I uh, see the guy sent me a couple different ones that I haven't had before, so I'm not much of a Tabasco guy, so <laughs> so I didn't use it. Peanut butter. What we got here? And this is just like a sports drink. It's like Gatorade, basically. This lemon lime sports drink. I don't personally like that, so I don't. Uh, I'm not gonna have that one. Matches. Keep those. Yeah. So. Raspberry jam, it says. Ooh, that's getting nice and warm. But I'm gonna finish this pulled pork and then we'll have some dessert. All right, guys, let's try this date square and this jam. It smells more like a jelly. I don't know if you're supposed to put it on here, but sometimes there's crackers in with these things, but. There's none in this one, so I don't really know what you're supposed to do with it. <laughs> it's a lot of jam. Mmm. Jeez, that's good. All right. That is some good jam. Mm. It's funny. Miles and miles away from civilization. So peaceful. You don't hear anything. It's the odd bird. Crazy. Love it. Hey, peanut butter. Try it on this half. It's pretty thick stuff. Yep. Not sure. Wow. Fire going down. I gotta go get going, so there's a ladder burn down. Oh yeah. Got that good heap and goop of uh, peanut butter. Oh, yeah. It's amazing. Mm. Mm. It's going to be getting on 3.30. Gets dark at 4.15, so we got probably... Oh, nine kilometer drive here with the sled, so 
once you snake around all these different trails and get out into the open and then I can book her across the spot where I came in and should be good. Should be about a 9k through this bush and then another 4 or 5 through that open spot. So yeah, always clean up your garbage. Well, it's not fired back up so hopefully we make it out. I'm gonna get going guys. Hopefully you enjoy that video and uh, if you did leave a comment and uh, we'll make some more of those. But yeah, thanks for sticking with me through 2022 and uh, hopefully 2023 will be another great year. We can keep uh, making videos uh, more consistently and uh, if you guys enjoy this kind of thing uh, let me know and I'll do some more of those or whatever. So I enjoy doing it so I'm, I might actually just make them regardless. So yeah. Like I said, some beautiful country in here. I'm gonna get going and uh, get out of here.